How did I color my hair? Really easy, really basic for me. For you, you're probably starting, so I'll suggest that you straighten your hair. Not perfect straight because you have to wash it and it's gonna go back to curly. Just enough that it's wavy. So you have that. You have watched my I Want This Hair Color video, so you have the products. Next. The only thing I suggest extra you need is a clip to hold lots of hair in it. What I did was my top section of my hair is going to have really thick, chunky uh, layers. And then the rest is going to be kind of thin. So I'm just going to take a section. I'm going to put my gloved hands into the dye, scoop a little bit. And from the roots to the tip, I'm just going to cover my section. And I'm just going to do that all throughout my hair. So then I have this section. I'm just going to clip it. Okay, and then my next section. Take a layer, zip, pull through. Do the same thing to different layers. And leave some of your natural hair color. Just do thin little streaks throughout your hair. And then you're going to do your whole entire head like that. Afterwards, when you go to rinse it out in the shower, wear your gloves, unless you want to have pink hands. It's not a good look, really. It's not. Plus, your nails are going to get pink if you have nail polish. That nail polish is going to be covered with pink, and it's just a really big mess. So that's just, just go in the shower with gloves when you condition your hair, shampoo, do all that stuff. Then you're going to come out, style it, not wash it for three days, let the color set in, and voila, you have this hair color. The only thing I don't suggest is if you have an unnatural hair color. Do not do your whole entire head that color. It's going to look bad. Like you can see, I have brown in my hair with my red. I have brown because when I walk around and I see platinum blonde girls with dark eyebrows, not a hot look. No, not a hot look at all. So just go and do little sections and you can leave your eyebrows alone. 